hello everyone welcome back to our youtube channel so today we'll learn how to import aliexpress product in our woocamera store wordpress so it, we, we are importing uh, our products from aliexpress to our uh, woocamera store in easy and basic step uh, we, by using a plugin so let's get started and before started please uh, don't forget to subscribe our youtube channel and thumbs up our video for latest and more content let's get started to uh, our so uh, here is our uh, WordPress dashboard. So we need a plugin. Go to plugin folder. Search Ali to Woo. So here's our plugin Ali to Woo. So just install that plugin. Once the install our plugins is uh, simple steps uh, activate that that plugin. So our plugin is activated. You can see here's Ali next uh, light version. So click here. So we have a very simple uh, now currently you can see in our products nothing, no product available. So you can search by categories. You can search by keywords. Let's suppose I am added airbirds from all category search. Here's, we have a lot of uh, products are here uh, related to our earbuds, our key keywords. So just choose any one products, just add to import list. So it's imp added to imported list. Go back to our products. So you can, it's added. If you want to add this one, Add to import list. You can select uh, multiple products if you want. You can, uh, let's suppose I am using this because it has a five star rating. So added. So now go to our import list. You can see here our products are in our queue. So this one and this one and this one, three products in a queue. So this is a select all products. So you can get full version. Oh, this is our update. Push to now we can push uh, push to our shop. Push all our products to shop. Press. Uh, are you sure you want to push? Yes. So it's a uh, three selected. Now your import list is empty. Go back to our products. Reload. I here you can see our all the products is uh, pushed in our store. So here's listed are the details because we are using our uh, basic uh, design. So it uh, take some time to uh, load the images. If you go to media, you can see images uh, uploading. Let me check what's the happening here. Yes. Setting. Uh, account setting here. Price ruling. Multiple. If you want to add a cost, extra cost, you can multiply your product cost, a fixed cost, custom price. Review setting. You can also import reviews. You just enable the reviews and the setting of your reviews. Shipping setting. You can also add a shipping setting. Here's all the shipping details and setting. Face filtering, API keys. Now, uh, API keys is basically used for uh, Chrome extension. We can discuss in the end of the video. So, uh, and import using extension also. Go back to our search products. Uh, let's check once again. Uh, images are still missing. So, we have add uh, again keyboard. Airbirds search we we'll add some other like this one again we can add a keyword so let's suppose add it to this one in our list add it to import this go to import so here's a, a publish simple product enter tags if you want to set out your custom categories according to your Kermit, uh, images, 
so gallery images select all images Vari variations use all variations spaces use all specs descriptions and products add some tags if you want to add so tags also added by default is a draft so now push again now go back to our products now I'm just still missing what's happening here let me check other all details come with SKU and type uh, variations attribute uh, attributes also here so product image is missing Let's check again media hour. Now uh, I'm just imported all the images. So it's a little uh, images take time. So uh, it's take some time because images is important from third website. So sometimes it's little take time. You can see here's all the options also added our sh ship from China. So it's a uh, really good for uh, our drop shipping uh, drop shipping website and our uh, any website we can import uh, products from aliexpress to uh, woocommerce so here's our basic and simple steps so images take time because uh, images is importing from a third party so it's uh, import importing sometime is a b better option you can just uh, make the products as a draft once the images is completed you can uh, make it publish so this is a draft product and you just click and edit quick edit make published and update so this is a uh, basic steps uh, how do we import uh, products from aliexpress to our woocamera store so now we are using our extension so get chrome extension if you want to import uh, aliexpress websites this is a chrome extension is only validated our chrome browser so just add the extension So our extension is added in the extension. Go to AliExpress. So extension is activated. So we need a API key for extension. Go to setting. Uh, once the setting, click the API key. Add a API key. Just name of API key and a copy of this code and save changes. So API is created. Now go back to here, AliExpress, options, right click and options, paste your API key and add store. So your st store is successfully added. So allow authentication. So now here's AirBirds surgery keyword so you can you can see here's uh, import all products if you want to import uh, if you want to add a specific product let's suppose you can select import all products or import a specific let's this one and this one this one mm, this one attempting authentication is take uh, some time to authenticate our website uh, let me check once again And let's first choose this one 
again fail still authenticated uh, reload uh, go back to our setting save changes back to list account setting uh, import list import list is empty and try again so just add your store id add to store save uh, close this all so close this one once again try our oh, country choose your country so import to list still uh, something uh, happening here is uh, I think so authentication issue uh, due to our uh, server but that is the method of uh, adding store and just make the import list is automatically listed show uh, here so you can just uh, push your products like that we can already add here uh, simple airbirds search if you want to add something other let's suppose men dress if you have a clothing website search so men dresses uh, something like this keywords so just add to import list go to import So you can also product ID using product ID or product URL. Uh, let's suppose we are getting this product. Still attempting to authenticate. Copy this one. And let's try with product URL. Import. Go to our import list. So you can see here. Uh, we have already two products here's our by URL heads are adding by this select all push to shop yes no sorry yes so these are uh, basic steps how to we import aliexpress to uh, woocommerce our products so, uh, with the sku with complete details our specs uh, variations price images you can add set up a uh, price multiplications and you can set up your categories according to your uh, store demand and your store configuration so it ha also has a uh, full version of a plugin in uh, theme forest uh, link, link in description so you can download from uh, that link and you can just purchase this uh, early dropship for WooCommerce. So this is the complete package where you can uh, place uh, uh, order ordered AliExpress dropship APIs, import products using very different variations and many more features we have uh, enabled by using this plugin. So uh, today we'll learn how to import our uh, products from AliExpress to our uh, WooCommerce store. If you like our video, please uh, thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel. Thank you.